Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome to yet another vlog. If you're new here, my name is Emily. If you are a returning subscriber, you friend, uh, my favorite person, and you don't even know it yet. So today is Monday, it's a holiday. I think it's now called Huduma Day. So I'm at home chilling and vibing. I have just done my morning skincare routine and I'm wearing this cute bob that I got at 5 Star Beauty Pro underscore KE. I'll leave the link somewhere down here. It's really cute and comfortable on my head and very easy to maintain. Got it for around 12k shillings and I'd recommend the hair. It's very easy to maintain. So yeah, I'm going to be chilling at home but first I want to make breakfast so let's do that and welcome to this week's vlog i hope you enjoy it Okay guys, so let me enjoy my breakfast. I'm having a toasted bun, plantain, bacon and leftover cake from a birthday I attended uh, last weekend. And this is a uh, coffee, white coffee with caramel syrup. And that is my breakfast. If you're new here, maybe see Bahati Shangi breakfast. I don't care about lunch and dinner, but breakfast is very important to me. So yeah. Let me have breakfast as I watch what Real Housewives of Potomac. Okay, so I just made dinner, which is coconut rice. Yeah, coconut rice with uh, nyayo beans that I soaked for six hours and then boiled them for about 45 minutes to an hour in my uh, pressure cooker. And these are stir fry veggies. It's a mixture of zucchini, red onion, carrot, and French peas. Are they called French peas? Yeah, I think that's what they're called. And that's water, maji muhimu. And that's half a glass of uh, red wine. So yeah, that is what I'm going to have for dinner. I've spent the whole day just uh, chilling and watching TV. And I'm about to go watch another doc series on netflix it's called bad spot i'll watch an episode or two and i'll see you guys tomorrow there is my food that i made and i usually don't cover my food until it's cold kabisa so that i can stop the cooking process so yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow good morning guys today is tuesday that feels like a monday because yesterday was um I learned it was actually Utamaduni day, not Huduma day. So for breakfast, I'm having raw cucumbers, smoky, mm, scrambled eggs and vegetables, samosas. And inside my teapot is hibiscus tea with some mint leaves and some lemon slices and with a little bit of sugar. And that is what I'm going to have for breakfast for today. 
once I sit on that desk, because I can already see emails are flowing, I don't know what time I'll get up. So let me have my breakfast and then get to work and we'll talk later. So I've been working for the past seven hours or so and I didn't feel like having uh, rice and beans that I made yesterday. Instead, I ordered uh, pork ribs from Big Square and a packet of fries in there, which is what I'm going to have with that glass of water. I'm super, super exhausted, but I've stored my lefties in the fridge and I'll have them probably tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. So let me enjoy my dinner over here and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Ciao, if you see me smiling sheepishly like that, you already know. I'm here to report that I didn't vlog much today. That's because my cleaning lady was here. But tomorrow, tomorrow is a date, so see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. I know I look crazy. I'm about to have breakfast, which is scrambled eggs, toasted bun, and bacon with a hot, hot cup of coffee. I have like uh, five emails that I need to send and make a few phone calls and then watch Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. I've been looking forward to watch that reunion child. So yeah, after that, I think I'll take a shower, go to town and get one sunscreen to a charger because mine imekufa in a charge kiwachilia then what else do i need to get i need to also get yes i need to get my certification stamp this one is just my advocate stamp i think i have misplaced it i don't know where it is but i know it is in this house but i need to certify some documents so i need to go and get a new stamp to certify those documents so yeah let me enjoy my breakfast as i work and we'll talk later i need to no 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 would you want me again Hi guys, it's time for me to go to town and do the stuff that I was talking about in the morning. So I'm here to submit the outfit of the day as well as the scent of the day and the lippy of the day. So my cute bob is from 5 Star Beauty Pro underscore KE. I left the link to their Instagram at the beginning of the video and my lippy of the day is this Zaron matte red lipstick in the shade Vavavavoom and you can get it also at uh, Jumia Mall shop number 49 it's called 5starbeautypro.ke I love it it takes a while to dry up and that's really nice especially if you're trying to achieve uh, an ombre matte combo so yeah as for the outfit of the day, I'm wearing this shift polka dot dress from Chica and this is my bag of the day and my sandals are from Zara. As for the saint of the day, I'm wearing Elizabeth Arden's white tee. This one is perfect to run an errand because I'm going for two hours maximum and then I'll be back. I'm just going to pick the things that I told you and buy a thing or two that I forgot to buy in the supermarket and then be back. So let me go and I'll catch you guys as soon as I'm back. I'm back and it's six past I'm going to do this mini haul standing because why not anyway 
So the first item that I got from town was a packet of uh, tissues. How I forgot to buy tissues when I did my grocery shopping last week. It's a story for another day, so I got that. I had also forgotten to buy Dio, so I got those two. They're my favorite, this one because it's truly invisible and this one smells amazing. And then I got, uh, I've opened this. This is my favorite candle from uh, Bath & Body Works. It's mahogany teakwood, high intensity. And then <laughs> these past mistakes have been very expensive because I got a charger type C and it was expensive actually. I didn't leave that costing that and then I got uh, a new stamp a new handy stamp which was also very expensive which is that my certification stamp before I find the other one because there are deadlines to be met and then the last item that I got was my sunscreen this is the one that I use for my face for my body I use uh, Neutrogena which I need to stop because Neutrogena is made by Johnson's and Johnson's company if I'm not wrong and child <laughs> Google is your friend things are thick there so I need to stop using the Neutrogena one so yeah I use this one for my face and that's all the stuff that I got I think and stay tuned because we're about to make dinner in this household and if I don't talk to you guys again, I'll see you guys tomorrow. So guys, I want to show you how you make a veggie stir fry. It's been requested by a lot of you guys. And I thought, let's make it together. So with me, I have zucchini, spring onion, bell peppers. There's the green one. There's the red one. And there's the yellow one. There's also two onions. There's the red onion and the white onion. They are carrots and these are snow peas you can use veggies of your choice so i'm going to chop all these up and then i'll show you guys the next step so i've cut everything up i just wanted to share a trick with the onions make sure you cut large pieces as opposed to tiny pieces because they'll cook fast and we want it to be crunchy so yeah that's that everything is here and the snow peas are there so let's cook now excuse me my cooker is a little bit dirty child so that's a medium high heat so the next step is to drizzle just tiny droplets of oil like that and then you add in blue bun depends on the amount of veggies that you're making so for me i think a tablespoon is enough so into that and we add oil so that uh, it doesn't smoke out my blue band and then at this point if you want your veggie spicy you can add a rico cube or a chili beef cube i'm not going to add any into mine because i don't want it spicy so as that melts you start with the crunchiest of them all which is the carrot so first that goes carrot you stir that for like uh, a minute or so. So I've changed my mind. I've added North beef and onion stew mix. You can get these at uh, Zucchini Food Plus. In the alternative, you can add a Rico cube or North chili beef cube. So after the carrots are cooked for like 45 seconds, you add in the zucchini, which is that. Add in a little bit of salt to taste. Stir that. And then go in with the snow peas. Remember guys, you are using a high heat. So you stir that as well. And then next is the bell peppers. Stir that as well. 
and then let all this cook for like one minute on high heat. So after one minute, you can add in black pepper, it's optional. And then you stir that as well. And then last but not least, you go in with the onions. I've mixed a variety for mine. Okay, you stir that as well. But then you can leave out onions. It's just that I'm a fan of onions. So that's why I included them. And you let it cook for one minute and you're done. So this is one way of making stir fry veggies. There are various ways and this is the oil blue band way. There is a boiling way that I'll probably show you in another vlog to come. So yeah, easy peasy, lemon squeezy and you're done. And dinner is ready. So there goes the stir fry veggie, the steak and mashed potatoes and a glass of red wine. And that is my dinner for today. Let me enjoy it and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Good morning! Hey, today I can tell it's going to be a busy day because it's now 10.30 and this is when I'm having breakfast. I've just certified this document so I want them to be picked in the next 30 minutes or so. So for breakfast I'm having those are smokies and vegetable samosas, plantain and to be honest this is my second cup of coffee because I needed to wake up. Started working at uh, around 8 and I'm about to have my breakfast and continue working up until I don't know when. You really can never tell. So that's all there is to today. So God help me. <laughs> listen 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 it's uh 5 21 now and this is when i'm getting up from my desk since i sat there so i'm on a work break and i'm just going to answer an email or two afterwards so there's not much to be done but in the meantime i have a sweet tooth so i made myself i'm going to have white chocolate and ice cream i'm going to top my ice cream with this pina colada dessert topping sauce and then after i finish i'm going to drink that bottle of water so yeah that's that we just wallow in my mulish cravings and i'll catch you guys later on good morning it's a beautiful day and it's saturday and this is my breakfast I'm having half a plain Jane bun, plantain, samosas, those are vegetable samosas, bacon, and hot chocolate. I don't know if you still call it hot chocolate if you don't put the milk. I don't know. But yeah, that is my breakfast. And I'm about to spend the day binge watching whatever show I'll find on Netflix. skincare glow okay so i feel like i've watched enough netflix so what i want to do is uh go change my plant let me show you guys uh i was told by my plant guy that this plant will never grow taller and i want it taller so i want to change it to something around that size and then and then i've also killed a plant that i need changed so my plant guy is almost here he's actually texted me that he'll be here in the next five minutes so we're going to go with him somewhere along gong road so where we're going to now exchange this plant and get a new plant for my balcony so yeah that's it and then i'll come back home and continue watching netflix so let's go
okay <laughs> there was no reason really but go big or go home so i exchanged my plant and i'm comfortable with that size i'm just worried in case it grows bigger than that so yeah that sums up my little trip to the plant guys and they're based along gong road ask for a guy called sam if he allows me i'll leave his number in the comment section so yeah that is that let me carry on with the day good morning good morning good morning today is sunday clearly from the background noise i've just taken a shower and i want to do my skincare routine before i make breakfast and then we can end this vlog and edit and then you can have it tomorrow by 10 a.m okay so first up is toner i've actually detailed uh these are uh, updated morning skincare routine on a previous vlog captioned so so if you're interested you could check it out And we are done, so now let's go make breakfast. So for breakfast today, I'm keeping it simple. I'm having sweet bananas and vegetable samosas. That's smoky. And that is my coffee with a little bit of caramel syrup. And that is breakfast for today. And with that, I think I can end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thank you for always supporting my channel. Let me go and edit this one and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.